For the community now, in less than a week, licensed gun holders will be able to carry in public, but there are some limitations. Officer Bernie Garza with Wesco Police Department joins us now with more. And thank you so much. You sped over here. Wait, he didn't really speed, right? From no. Wesco because you guys just wrapped up your first open carry discussion. Correct. There was a presentation we put on this morning there at the Wesco City Hall EDC. Uh, we also have one scheduled for this afternoon from uh, 1 o'clock to 2 o'clock. Yeah, in less than an hour. So what was the overall reaction from the public this morning? We had about 60 people, more or less, there, wow. ju just from the general public, from business owners and just uh, regular citizens coming in, uh, wanting to know some uh, aspects as to open carry law that takes effect January 1. Yeah, and what are some things that people need to know before this takes place on Friday? Yep, yes, correct. Uh, their main thing is, uh, and we know it from a law enfor uh, enforcement perspective, they're going to be calling us. There's somebody with a gun. Because uh, you want to carry a gun doesn't mean you, you can. You still have to go through a training class. You can't be a convicted felon. No class A or B misdemeanor convictions. Uh, you do a background check. Uh, you're going to have to have a handgun license. If you currently have a concealed handgun license, CHL, it'll carry over for the open carry. Uh, if you don't have any, any of it, you have to go through that training class first, get your license, and then you're able to carry uh, open carry. It's got to be holstered now. Right. It can't be inside the waistband or inside the pants. Uh, it's got to be holstered on the hip or in the shoulder. And as for law enforcement, like you said, you are anticipating probably a lot of people calling because it is going to be alarming at first to see a whole bunch of people. It's going to be alarming. It, it's going to be alarming. And then for a, a lot of the business people, um, it's going to have to, they're going to have to post, uh, clearly post on the, on the entrances, uh, even side entrances uh, with a poster one inch. It's got to be certain criteria. Uh, on the posting of the signs, which is a 30.06 is the uh, concealed handgun license, and the 30.07 is for the open carry handgun license. If you want to uh, prohibit any firearms into your business, you have to clearly post those. Or you have the option of just not posting them, but you verbally advise the person if they have the open carry that firearms are not welcome on your property. And of course, you have the 51%, uh, the alcohol, those are prohibited regardless. Right, so you just had your discussion you know this morning you're going to hold another one in just about 30 minutes at one o'clock and again this yes. is open up to the public yes it is it's it's free no no charge for it all right well thank you so much bernie i know you have to go back and get back to the second session true, true, true. <laughs> thanks thank for having us yeah of course